G'day, Paul here out in the bush in the National Park and I'm beginning a reading of Psalm 104 from the New International Readers Version. Beautiful Psalm but I'll read different verses in different places. We're starting up here in the bush near an old ant's nest. I will praise the Lord, Lord my God. You are very great. You are dressed in glory and majesty. You wrap yourself in light as if it were a robe. You spread the heavens out like a tent. You build your palace high in the heavens. You make the clouds serve you as your chariot. You ride on the wings of the wind. You make the winds serve as your messengers. You make flashes of lightning serve you. Continuing the psalm from verse 5. You place the earth on its foundations. It can never be moved. You covered it with the oceans like a blanket. The waters covered the mountains. But you commanded the waters and they ran away. At the sound of your thunder, they rushed off. They flowed down the mountains. They went into the valleys. They went to the place you appointed for them. You drew a line they can't cross. They will never cover the earth again. You make springs pour water into the valleys. It flows between the mountains. The springs give water to all of the wild animals. The wild donkeys satisfy their thirst. The birds of the air build nests by the waters. They sing among the branches. You water the mountains from your palace high in the clouds. The earth is filled with the things that you have made. You make grass grow for the cattle and plants for the people to take care of. That's how they get food from the earth. There is wine to make people glad. There is olive oil to make them healthy. And there is bread to make them strong. The cedar trees of Lebanon belong to the Lord. You planted them and gave them plenty of water. The, there the birds make their nests. The stork has its home in the pine trees. The high mountains belong to the wild goats. The cliffs are a safe place for the rock badgers. The moon serves to mark off the seasons. The sun's, sun knows when to go down. You bring darkness and it becomes night. Then all the animals of the forest prowl around. The lions roar while they hunt. All of their food comes from God. The sun rises and they slip away. They return to their dens and lie down. Then a man gets up and goes to work. He keeps working until evening. Lord, you have made so many things. How wise you were when you made all of them. The earth is full of your creatures. Look at the ocean, so big and wide. It is filled with more creatures than people can count. It is filled with living things from the largest to the smallest. All of those creatures depend on you to give them their food when they need it. When you give it to them, they eat it. When you open your hand, they are satisfied with good things. When you turn your face away from them, they are terrified. When you take away their breath, they die and turn back to dust. When you send your spirit, you create them. You give new life to the earth. May the glory of the Lord endure forever. May the Lord rejoice in his works. He looks on the earth and it trembles. He touches the hills and they smoke. I will sing to the Lord as long as I live. I will sing praise to my God while I have my being. May my meditation be sweet to him. I will be glad in the Lord. May sinners be consumed from the earth and the wicked be no more. Bless the Lord, O oh my soul. Praise the Lord. What a beautiful psalm, talking about the wonders and the amazing things that God has done for us in creation, in all of creation. Beautiful psalm. Strongly recommend you read it yourself, reread it, get it into your spirit, get the word into you. You get into the word and let the word of God get into you. You have a great day from Lake Baroon. See you later. God bless you.